Thank you for watching Access Hockey Michigan. Throughout this season, we're going to be highlighting the Muskegon Lumberjacks and having exclusive player interviews. And this week, we're highlighting Colby Bukas, uh, formerly a commit, a college commit, who's decided to return to the USHL. And we sat down with him to discuss what his thoughts were and his reasoning behind that. So go ahead and keep watching this video and be sure to follow us on all social media for more exclusive information and interviews. Bukas, so there was a couple questions uh, that we had in regards to you coming back to the USHL. So we're going to just kick this off and talk about that here. Uh, you were committed. Yep. So what changed your mind? What made you come back for one more season with the Jacks? Uh, there was a lot of talk with the coaches here and uh, Mankato. Um, just thought it'd be most beneficial for me uh, just to improve my game and really just develop my style of play with one more year in the USHL. And I mean, doesn't hurt another year without school, so <laughs> it makes it fun. <laughs> you get it while you can, right? Exactly. What are you focusing on in this season then while you have time left here? Um, I would just say my leadership skills. I mean, we're in a C this year along with Sully and Matthew Stodicker. Um, just get the guys real close together from the beginning, start of the season, and just kick things off real well. Mm -hmm. Now, do you feel like there's a lot of pressure on you now that you're getting the C on there, or is that something where... You're just you're just embracing it yeah. because this is a natural uh, position for you. In a sense, with my Thunderbird team, I wore a C there, and I mean, my biggest thing was just to get the guys close, have fun on the ice, and my Camel Tim, his biggest thing's energy and just have a fun year and make the practices fun, games fun, just high energy, high tempo. Mm -hmm. So now, how do you, how do you feel the culture has shifted at all under Mike? Is it um, very different from when it was when you guys had Lafontaine? I would say it's a huge improvement. I mean. I love him to death and just I love the energy he has mm -hmm. and just the fun we're having here like want to come to the rink and enjoy every day mm -hmm. so it's not work yeah, yeah exactly yeah now what what can fans expect out of you guys this year what kind of uh, what kind of energy are you going to be trying to project early on in the season and you know making a point against your opponents what are you going to do to make that happen um I just think with the depth we have right now we have four or five solid lines and I mean the past two seasons, last year, we had Anthony Del Gaizo, year before Sveshnikov, high mm -hmm. top leading scorers and stuff. This year, we have just really like deep team that can produce 20 points each and just have that successful season we mm -hmm. need. So yeah, just finish strong, hopefully. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Awesome. All right.